Hajj is one of the five pillars of Islam. The annual pilgrimage to Mecca is a mandatory requirement for physically and financially capable Muslims at least once in their lives. It occurs in the month of Dhul Hijjah, which is the 12th month of the Islamic lunar calendar. Over 4 million pilgrims travel to Saudi Arabia for the annual pilgrimage. They include at least 4,500 Kenyans. For ease of travel logistics, Saudi Arabia authorities have released new rules and regulation for the 2019 Hajj. Which is what rules and regulations are going to be laid out by the Saudi government. We have to find how we can fit in within those rules and regulations and prepare ourselves in advance. And that's what's happening now. For the first time we are hearing, they are closing, they are closing dates of everything. By 30th June, if you don't have your passport, forget about travel. These were not there before. So you'll have 30 days before actually the visa is going to be closed. The Supreme Council of Kenya Muslims, Subkem National Chairperson Ambassador Dr. Yusuf Nzibo, urged Kenyan Muslims who wish to perform this year pilgrimage to Mecca to comply and process the traveling documents by 30th of June 2019. A number of countries, including Trouble Somalia, have already gone ahead, booked premises, booked tents for Minna, and made other preparations. And therefore, it calls upon us Kenyans, a country is well, that is well known in terms of its organization, its structures, its infrastructure, that we begin this process early enough to allow the Saudi authorities, who are expecting guests of Allah close to three to four million people, to be able to make logistic arrangements early enough. Subkem Secretary General Mohammed Adan Mahat praised the government for assisting those planning to travel to Mecca. Uh, every other time, the Hajj, the Hajj rules changes with Saudi Arabia. And we, as the body mandated on behalf of Muslims, with responsibility of taking care of Kenyans who are going to Hajj, we get the instructions from Saudi Arabia and we pass to our respective agents who are supposed to carry people to Saudi Arabia. Our government is also very concerned that every year we are sending 4,500 people from here to Mecca. The government of Kenya is also very, very concerned about the welfare of the Kenyans, 4,000. It's only during Hajj that 4,500 to 5,000 Kenyans live at the same time and come back at the same time. The first Hajj flight will depart on the 4th of July and the last flight will be on the 5th of August.